I would say my first impression of Oxford is, wow, it's so historic. It's a beautiful city. Walking around it, it's very surreal. You get to be part of these old colleges that are so serene on the inside and have so much history to it. I think the MFE is a very rigorous course that really combines the best of both finance and economics. We look at the theoretical underpinnings behind the economic models or the financial models that we use and that practitioners use on a daily basis. When you get here, you get here basically about four weeks before Oxford starts for most students where we have a three to four week introductory program only for the MFE. My first impressions of Oxford could be summarized with the phrase I didn't know all this Harry Potter stuff was real. I came here and was immediately blown away by the architecture, the traditions, the college dinners, the rowing. Um, it's all so unique and has been here for centuries and it's incredible to just be part of this institution. So this course is for people who are interested in learning more about economics and finance at quite a deep level. Finance, in particular corporate finance and asset pricing, that's my bit, the price of stocks and bonds. And probably people who are interested in having a career in a top tier finance firm after they graduate. It really prepares us because it allows us to be discerning users of these models. We're not just applying them, memorizing them and just applying them blindly, but we understand what we're doing and we understand how to modify those models and modify the assumptions behind them. So it's a very rigorous and theoretical course that is absolutely useful in the practical world too. So I think side business school is special because it really tries to position itself as sort of the ethical business school. That's the impression that I've had while I've been here. So it guides you in learning the impact of a corporation and the way to use it to improve the world and society. Uh, the MFE as a program is very academically rigorous and you'll end up knowing all of the theories of financial economics. So having that combination of, of academics and sort of ethical guidance I think is very unique um, in sending people off into their careers. If you look at MFE and compare it to a traditional masters of finance, you may find that uh, the economics part is emphasized a little more. Uh, we actually taught macroeconomics, microeconomics, we taught a fair deal of econometrics uh, that you may not usually just learn from a typical master's of finance. So I think rather than being a type of practical training to take your first job in finance, it's more about how you think. It's about learning to think structured about markets, the economy. That's really the core focus of the degree to me. I wanted something on my CV that would add a little bit more credibility. Um, and I really think MFE was the right program for that. I also wanted to take advantage of the network in the university. Um, and I think it's very useful for that. You meet really incredible people. There's loads of events that you can go to. You're in the same building as the MBAs. And generally, the pull of Oxford in interviews, I mean, that really gives you an advantage when you're looking for a job. As an MFE student, you get automatic lifetime membership of the Oxford Union. And the Oxford Union is one of the oldest speaking and debating societies in the world. We get a lot of politicians, celebrities, and just famous people that come. And it's a really unique experience. I had the opportunity to also be sponsorship officer and I was able to speak in one of those historic debates and that is a very unique uh, once in a lifetime experience that I will never forget. So if you're looking for a course that is going to challenge you, that will expand your worldview, get you to interact with amazing people and help you make that next step in your career, um, then apply to the MFE.